any video, you have stumbled across my channel or you're subscribed to me. Either way, I love ya and I hope you guys like this video. So, I have exactly two weeks left in my hometown until I move to England. Ah! I thought that I would do two weeks of just straight daily videos like just so it's a daily video every day and then we're gonna go to England together and I'm gonna be vlogging it so it's gonna be amazing what I've done is I wrote down suggestions and my own ideas in a hat and I'm gonna randomly pick one and then each day I'm gonna make a video about it so each day will be a surprise for you and me I just want to spread the positivity and there's stuff that I want to give advice on because there's younger viewers out here that are watching me and you know I just I want to help out you know Let's start off this two week daily videos with MC with Today's positivity video is going to be embracing change Woo! Oh god, there's enough oil on my hair to fry some good old potatoes for each and every one of my viewers Change normally means like shifting things shifting out of the norm, you know things are changing But think of it this way like change like literal change like coins now when you go to the shops and the sales assistant gives you your change you're like oh heck yes I have change now I can go buy some other stuff or I have parking meter change yes heck yes some people don't like change and they don't like to carry around all these coins and they're like oh it's gonna make so much noise and it's so heavy ah ah likewise with change in our lives some people are just so loving change you're like Oh yes, I love change. I'm so bored with my life. This change is gonna be amazing. While other people are like, oh, I just hate change. Like I'm so comfortable and I just love my life right now. And why do things have to just turn bad when they're so good right now? It's inevitable. For me, I was just fighting the change. Like I was a wet sock to myself and I was trying to fake it so hard on videos like, hey guys, it's MZ, positivity, blah, blah, blah. When on the inside, I was feeling like I just wanted to be super honest and just blatantly like, you know what, let's cut the crap, this is how it is, blah blah blah. But I was so contradicted. I realized, and with the help of my best friend and my mom and stuff, I realized that, you know, change is super inevitable and we just gotta embrace it, you know? Because with bad things, they won't last forever. Good things will come. But with good things, bad things will come too. Or maybe more good things, you know? Let's also talk about another thing about change. This, my god. Mount Everest has decided to just set up camp right in the middle of my face. I had to embrace this change because it's literally in the middle of my face and whenever I get pimples and stuff, I don't like to put concealer over it because I'm like, you know what? It's probably just gonna make it worse. Why not just embrace it and just go out and rock it? Everybody has pimples. Here are three tips for embracing change. One, look at it as a great thing. This is growth. You're growing with this. You're learning, you're gaining experience. Shitty situation isn't gonna last forever. Likewise, if it's a great change, then and soak it up man this is amazing tip number two this world is literally a game the cycle of life from birth to death is all up to you no matter how much our parents our teachers influencers influence us ultimately the decision is up to you and how you live your life you're affected by other people you have your mind you have your soul and your heart and your body to figure out what you want and how you're gonna run your life. You can say, cool, this is change. Like, okay, let's ride it out. Let's see where this goes. Or you can say, nah, I'm not down for this change. I'm gonna go somewhere else. I'm gonna go change something else. I'm gonna go just do something else and change my life's direction. And you can totally do that, okay? Change is inevitable, but the way we deal with it and how we handle it is up to us. If you go to a buffet and someone says, oh yeah, we only have baked potatoes or french fries, sorry, and half an hour ago you were absolutely sure that they also had mashed potatoes, but now they don't, but these are your options, you can either choose one of these or both of them because who doesn't love potatoes, right? Or you can walk away. Ultimately, change here is inevitable. Change is here. But it's up to you whether you choose to eat the potatoes, walk away, or what you want to do. We have the choice of how we embrace it. I love you guys. Stay positive, stay strong. I'll see you guys for tomorrow's video because there are daily videos now. Mwah!